Good evening, everyone. First of all, I'd like to thank Jody Steinbauer and the entire uh, Hall of Fame committee for this amazing honor. Um, I'd like to just thank God. Um, you got it? Cool. All right, I'd like to thank God for just giving me the talent and the ability to play the sport of basketball, which uh, allowed me to be here tonight to receive such an amazing, amazing honor and to join an elite group of athletes and coaches that have worn the orange and green of the University of Miami. As a kid who only played organized basketball for five years prior to uh, attending Miami, I would have never imagined something as special as joining the Hall of Fame would be happening to me. One of the things I remember most is playing basketball, is getting the opportunity to play basketball in my own backyard and have my family and friends close to me. With that being said, i like to thank um, my mother, Deborah Jordan, for just being here for me with her unconditional love and support. Thank you. Whether it was being the first to greet me with a hug and a kiss after a great game or the first to console me after a tough one, she's just always been there through it all. And I don't know where I would be without her right now. And I just love you, Mom, for that. I also like to thank my father, James Blue, even though he doesn't live in Florida anymore, he continued to give me, his, give me his support from afar. He lives up in Syracuse, New York, and every time we go up there and play Syracuse, he'd always like gather up everyone to create my own little cheering section. So I had that going on when I was up in Syracuse, and I want you to know that that, that meant a lot to me. I thank you for it and love you for that as well. to the president of the Octavia Blue Fan Club, my brother Lawrence, oh my God. I just gotta tell you guys, my brother, I don't know. Um, I'm all banged up and doesn't matter how old I get, he never thinks I'm gonna stop playing basketball. So to my brother, if there wasn't a time to ever tell you, I guess now is the time to tell you I'm done. It's over with, all right? <laughs> but um, thank you for just being my biggest fan and supporting me in my entire career. I love you for that. To my sister Renee, I want to thank you for making that trip from Fort Lauderdale to Miami to bring my niece Shatira to just watch me play. I never realized how much I meant to her as she uh, idolized and considered me as one of her uh, heroes. And I'm just honored to have her think of me in that capacity. Just thank you for everything. To my sisters Erica and Tasha, I want to thank you for supporting me as well. When um, you think about women's basketball in Miami, you think about Coach Fern Labadi. To me, Coach Labali meant the world to me. Um, I, just, I, I just can't say enough when it comes to Coach Labali because not only did I realize that Coach Labali cared about Octavia Blue, the basketball player, I knew that she cared about Octavia Blue, the person. Because when I left Miami in 1998 for the WNBA, I had two classes to complete my degree at Miami. My mom and Coach Labadi formed an alliance and they stayed on me up until I came back to Miami to complete the two classes that I nearly put off for 10 years while I was playing professionally. And when I finally got it done, she was the first person to call me, congratulate me, and just, you know, be there for me. And Coach Lobody, I just want to say to you that I feel fortunate to have um, played under your tutelage and just have you in my life right now that I feel I have a relationship that you have, I have your continued support for the rest of my life. I thank you for that. I also like to thank the rest of my college coaching staff, Coach Robin Harmony, Tony Smiley, Nina Wagner, for all of your guidance and support throughout my college career because you guided me and you uh, just refined my skills to help me achieve some of my biggest accomplishments in my life, such as playing on the highest level in the WNBA, seeing the world throughout Europe as a pre professional basketball player. I just thank you guys for that. To Coach Harmony, I want to thank you for giving me the opportunity to step outside and, you know, on the other side of the, of the ball as assistant coach at St. Thomas University. I now see why you guys were about to pull your hair out. <laughs> These girls are driving me nuts, but hey, I got to say I love the game and I love being around. I want to thank you for this opportunity. And last but not least, I want to thank my teammates, you guys, played such an integral part of my success, and I definitely wouldn't be here without you guys. To Paul D. and in the entire athletic department and academic support staff, I wanna thank you guys as well. Just standing here and reflecting back over my basketball career, I can say that I've been a lot of places. 
I've seen a lot of things and I had a host of accomplishments, awards, and accolades. But I gotta say, being inducted to the UM Sports Hall of Fame has to be one of the biggest of them all. I thank you all. Good night. Well done. Thank you so much. Congratulations.